All right, so there are your keys for the room. Now, did you have a car you need to park with us? Uh, yeah, I'm in one of those spaces out front. There's a sign that says something like hotel guests only. I think I'm good to park there. Well, actually, those signs say that those parking spots are for residents only, not hotel guests. We're right across from some condos, and those parking spots are for the people who live in those condos, not for our hotel. No, sweetie, I'm pretty sure those spaces are for hotel guests. Uh, the only parking spaces our hotel offers are in the back in our gated lot. Um, the sign clearly says it's for hotel guests. Well, for the year that I've worked here, those spots have been residents only. Well, they must have changed it and just not told you. Here, I'll go outside and I'll take a picture for you. Okay, honey? Okay. Yeah, please do. Okay, I'll be right back and you'll see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. Hey, um, I have a question for you. Hi, yes, how can I assist? Yeah, uh, where can I find the closest convenience store? Well, the closest convenience store is probably going to be about a five minute drive away. If you want, I may have what you're looking for in the back if it's like a toothbrush or something. Well, uh, I'm looking for condoms. Oh, no, no, we don't have those. I uh, know, sorry. Yeah, I figured. Yeah, sorry, so you'll just want to go five minutes up the road. Thanks. Oh, hey, welcome back. Did you, uh, did you find what you were looking for? Right, the con, yeah, I, I forgot you, uh, yeah. Thank you for calling guest services, how may I assist? Hi, I was wondering if I could move rooms. The um, people next to me are really loud. Oh, um, may I go ahead and send my security up to the other room first and see if they'll be quiet just so that way you don't have to move so late in the evening? No, um, I don't think that's gonna work. Uh, may I ask why? Well, they're making um, honeymoon kind of noises. Oh, yeah, it's been going all night and it's it's 2.45. I, I kind of just want to get a different room. No, I completely understand and I am so sorry. Um, someone will be at your room shortly to help you move your bags to the new room, okay? Okay, thanks, sweetie. It's my pleasure and again, I'm so sorry. Okay, bye-bye. Ew. Thank you for calling guest services. This is Jessica. How may I assist you? Transfer me to room service. Oh, I'm sorry, but room service is closed. So I can't just get a dessert? Uh, no, the kitchen is closed. But I'm trying to order dessert. The kitchen is closed? <laughs> when did room service end? Room service ended at 10 p.m. So you're telling me room service ended eight minutes ago and they can't just get me a little dessert? No, because the kitchen is closed. <laughs> oh, hmm. <laughs> Did you hear that last guest just go off on me because we had changed his room type from a king to a double queen? He was sitting there saying, well, I can't possibly sleep in a queen bed. Dude, you're traveling alone. I'm pretty sure you'll fit. You'll be just fine. Yeah, I know it's annoying, but you know, I'm used to sleeping in a king bed, so I, I get it. Like, it'd be hard for me to sleep in a queen, too. Well, I mean, I still sleep in a twin just fine. Really? You still sleep in a twin? Well, yeah, I mean, okay, think about it. In the end, a bed is just a shelf you put your body on when you're not using it, right? What? A bed is just a shelf you put your body on when you're not using it. I can honestly say I've never heard that before. All right, I'm gonna need the lights down, the music down, everybody go to bed. I... Two energy drinks is not gonna be enough. What? They want room service now? It's been closed for an hour. I don't know where they could get food. That's not my problem. Tell them to go to sleep already. What the heck is with people? No, I know I'm not sleeping. I'm not asleep. No, um, I'm gonna get another energy drink. God, can you give me some warning before you turn on the lights? Oh. Hey, good morning. Morning, morning. It's six o'clock in the morning. How do you guys have so much energy? I'm ready to go. My lemonade, I'm ready to go. Let's do this. Oh, I'm so sorry. Room service is closed, but hey, why don't you do Uber Eats and I'll see if I can find your discount code, yeah? Oh, I don't really get tired on overnights. I mean, I invert my day, so this is basically my afternoon. Yeah. Actually, can you keep the lights on? Yeah, it helps me stay energized. Cool, thank you. Good morning, welcome in. Oh, I'm just excited to see you. Oh, I do not think so. Get back here. Hi, 911. Can you come pick me up? It is a Wednesday. You saw what in the guest's room? Hi, 
this is the front desk manager of the hotel that you're staying at. Yes, I just received a report from our housekeeper that you have your pet hamster in the room. Yes, I do apologize, but I'm going to need to ask you to remove the hamster. We do not allow for small pets at our property because if they escape, they cause a very big issue. It's your emotional support hamster. No, please do not bring it to the front desk to show it to me. I, I do not get paid enough. Got the next guest over here. Hi, I've been waiting for like two hours for someone to bring my bags to my room and I keep calling the bell stand and they're telling me they can't bring it because of like the weather. Yes, I do apologize, but as long as there's lightning in the area, we can't send any of our employees out. Delivering bags is a service this hotel is supposed to provide, and you're not providing that service to me. Well, that is absolutely a service we provide, and as soon as the lightning is cleared, we will resume. Okay, but the storm is supposed to go on to like 9 p.m. What is your guys' plan? Well, any guests who needs their bags while it's storming are more than welcome to come to the bell stand, and the bell stand will give them their luggage to then bring to their own room. The chances of getting struck by lightning are one in a million. Like, just send someone out to deliver my bags. Well, as long as there is a chance, we are not going to take a risk on our employees' lives. So you're more than welcome to go to the bath stand right over there. Fine. 